So here's our extended cut on the trunk and treats. Now I'm not going to open this, but this is all, well actually, let's open the top for just a second. I want to show you this. If you open this box, maybe not. Oh, it'll open. It's not done. So that's what I wanted to show. That's all ready to go with all of the details and decals and things like that. So let's put that top back on. And I want to show you some of the pieces, even on this box. Now this box, you can obviously see buy two, get one. There we go. Thank you. Where we have our different engine options, which is really so cool. And we just got done seeing the interior. Let's show this the other side. This one over here. So here we have our two-in-one. Let's go around with the side. Now this, first of all, notice right there in Morton Grove, Illinois, and we've got the 69 Camaro and the 69 Z28. I've paused long enough where you should be able to see and read that. Let's go to the last side. And that shows the two-in-one as well. Okay, so we'll take that away. And this, Dirk shared with us in the video that this was a dealer promo piece that he found. He's never seen another one like that. And we've got the Impala 427 convertible there. And while he's taking that piece away, I just want to show you a bit of this. Dirk, Dirk I'll let you take that. You know, all the time, my wife usually when I come home looks exactly like that on the front of my car when I'm coming home. Hello, Lou. So good to see you. After another My Car Story, Lou. And then you've got the Carl's Bad. It shows some of the cars. And there's our Chevrolet. Now, I'm not going to go through this in super detail, but I just want to give you a flavor of what we're looking at. So they literally take you from 1911 all the way through. Now kind of fast forward a bit. But a really cool book and you start to get actual pictures and drawings the quality reflects the tradition. Hello, sailor. The girls with the cars. <laughs> oh, that's great. There's why your pilots love the Corvette. It's in their blood. So here's your engine choices. A 6, 327, a 350, a 427. Kind of surprised they didn't have the, uh, the assembly plants. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's styling right there. So I thought you'd enjoy that. That baby grand. Okay. Dirk, I'm going to hand you that. Let me go to this one. And we featured this already. I think you could, there you could see the light a little bit better. See it there? When you push on the GM, it gives you that light. So cool. And obviously, properly working. So here was the salesman's custom feature catalog. Showing the different interiors of the different cars. The four season air conditioning automatically controlled. There's your Comfortron. That's quite the interesting word. There's your under dash blower motors and your frigid air compressor. Some antennas, trailer hitches. There's our rear deck luggage carrier that we feature on this car. Power brakes, locking gas cap. There's our auto compass. 
that you see the part number for. Electronic clocks, polishing cloths, rear window deflector, saddle type litter container, your luggage carrier with the Chevrolet bow tie on it, your simulated rims or wheel covers. One of my viewers corrected me and said, Lou, stop saying hubcaps. Wheel covers. So there you go. Wheel covers that we have here. There's your tissue dispenser that this one features. Hose tenna. I'm not sure what a hose tenna is, but there it is. Rear window defogger. Our bumper guards. Fender guards. Gas filler door guard. Horns. Trailer hitches. Deluxe pedal trim kit. Nice. Engine block heater. Quite a gathering. An ashtray light. Wow. For those of you who love the Trunk and Treats, we present them to you. The rubber mats, mirrors, trunk opener, inside button, notice there, trunk armrest. Not sure I'd be in the trunk needing that, but you never know. Ski racks. Not an option probably in Arizona. Radios, front speakers, hand portable spotlight, the tachometer that you can add, rear seat belt retractors, the front speakers, there's your stereo tape player, your tape cartridge holder, holding all four cassettes there for you, the eight tracks at the time. Side step for the fleet side. Look at the GM safety seat. That right there says safety. Strap them into that one. It looks like a, I don't know what it looks like. I'll just let it speak for itself. The Camaro, the Corvair, the two-way citizens van, our trucks. I will give you that one. And last but not least. I'll call it the piece de resistance. Here we have the dealer brochure featuring color fabrics, exterior colors, as you can see, all of the colors. There. There's our Cortez Silver on this car. I'm going to feature that. This is great, the fabrics. Impala, the Caprice, the Chevelle. Notice current car companies. Look at the colors. <laughs> the options. The Camaro. The Chevelle. The Corvair. It's kind of interesting. The Corvair and the Corvette have the same options. <clears throat> and your convertible and vinyl tops. Your Bel Air, your Biscayne, your Impala, your 69 Chevy. I'll give you just some of the I'll try to go through this slow enough you know it's not me blurring the picture and yet give you as much as possible for those who love this that's pretty cool right there it's the silent ones who are usually the strongest. 
The going gets rough. This 427 convertible is a good example. <laughs> The Caprice will step up. Ah, the girl in the window. Happens all the time for me. There's my editor. His girlfriend sneaking into the car. Speeding away from a interesting situation. The guard dog ready for action. There's that child seat with child in it. Okay, we actually see. Well, that that would not fly very well now. Rear window defogger. He's got the little scarf on. Thank goodness. And there's our engine teams. I'll feature that for a second. And the all important. I'll see you later taking off down the road. So it goes through the safety features, the wheel cover options. So I'm going to go a little smoother through that. I will stop at some of the more maybe interesting ones like the 427 SS features. There you go. Why not? A bright accents, they call it. There's the word hubcaps right there, just for my wheel cover friends. And we can go on. There's the Bel Air, the Biscayne, the Power Teams, etc. So I'm going to go to the next spot, which is the Chevelle. Over here, it talks about some of the new features. of LSS, the first 50 reasons for owning one. Your four-door, I don't know what's going on over here. There was a dog involved. That's the look that says, honey, we're lost. I'm pretty sure this is not Chicago. <laughs> that's, that's what happens to you. We called Chevelle the concentrated Chevrolet just to add gas. And just take it down to the beach. Or a brook. The 300 Deluxe Sport Coupe. Now they finally got back to Chicago, or a city big enough for them. No longer in the desert. And the child seat. God, that just looks dangerous now. And here's your cars. Your engine options. All right, I'm gonna go through. There's the SS Chevelle. Again, we could go through the 300 Deluxe, the Power Teams, etc. Some of the accessories they show. What a great brochure. We'll feature some wagons. Our Caprice. The Kingswood Estate. A massive wooded slash vinyl sided vehicle that it is. Nobody was ever believing that it was actual wood. Nicely faded when the sun hit it for more than two years. Come on out, Mom. Yeah, you just fit right in there. Or your planks. Or your birthday gifts. That looks more like a wedding party or something. The Chevelle wagon.
Taking the family out. Oh, look at that. Happy in that seat. There's your different types there. We'll move through that. We'll go to where we're at right now. The mighty Camaro. We got the 69 Camaro. Putting you first keeps us first. The hugger. Who needs to say new or better? The 350. Here's a look. I'll get that look for you. Focused. She's focused on him, naturally. It's exactly how it is when you're driving a Camaro. Very proud. Looking very cool in your SS all muscle car. And I almost missed the RS. Stylish. Rally Sport. This is the spirit, spirited way to challenge the road. Ask the kid who owns one. Nice. Make sure that I keep that right there. Just remove that there. Some of the optional pieces inside. So you've got your Camaro, your interiors, our luggage rack, the extras, the headlight washer. Hmm. Headlight washer option. I don't know if I ever knew that they had that. I'm just so happy with my Camaro, I'm going to hug myself. And the Camaro checklist. Over to the Rally Sport. There's our wheel covers. Thank you, viewers, for helping me help me. That's cool. Just the work that went into this book. Just unbelievable. And they did it every year. Crazy, right? This gave the marketing people something to do. Your SS Nova. Nice. Handsome and sporty. People on the bike can catch you in your Nova. It's not necessarily a great marketing tool there. But playing the uh, banjo, that's always a good time. Because anytime you hear a banjo, you got to start smiling. And this guy apparently doesn't want to have anything to do with that, so he's out of there. Those are some nice wheel covers. Build your own Nova. There's some Nova features there. We go to the Corvair. The last year for the Corvair. I don't have much on the Corvair. There. Luggage on the luggage rack. That's something you don't see. Ever. Because that notice will come right off the back of that car. The Corvette's going so fast. No, that's not me shaking the camera. It's just super imposed. That's cool. That looks good. Five horsepower. There's some engine options. The side pipes, wheel covers.
Notice the girls keenly focused on the guy when driving a Corvette. As it should be. Our locks and our trucks. They're calling the El Camino a truck. That's a truck. Here's the El Camino. Nice with the surfboards in the back. I actually really like that. No, don't bring it to a construction site. Bricks are not going to help. Super cool. And this actually folds this way, as you can see. The sports van. Sport van interior. And finally, the underside. And that's some trunk and treats.